Uh, the Arab uh, Palestinian community within Israel constitute about 20% of uh, the population, and uh, we have been uh, suffering from discrimination and uh, exclusion. Uh, the issues of uh, respecting our uh, mother tongue language, the issue of uh, uh, autonomy in education, the issue of uh, representation in the civic services, the issue of uh, political participation. And we also point to the police, the Israeli police, that it's not taking its responsibility in investigating and in indicting people who are involved in this violence. It looks that it's comfortable for the police in Israel to leave this internal violence going on without taking action. Nation state law. Uh, this is a law that uh, uh, clearly uh, discriminates against the, uh, the Arab Palestinian citizens of Israel uh, by uh, basically uh, categorizing them as a second or third class uh, citizens. So we see this as an attack not just on our language, but on our culture, on our history, and on our uh, status as cultural and ethnic uh, minority. main recommendations how state officials uh, could deal uh, uh, with that and uh, close these gaps. Most equitable education systems are always the most advanced education systems as well. Supporting uh, a peace uh, a solution for the ongoing conflict in the Middle East through establishing a Palestinian state alongside Israel on 1967 borders this is the platform that has been adopted by the international community, supported by international law. There is a, a one a possible for a peace in this region, mm -hmm. and with this one possible option is by recognizing the right of the Palestinian people of having a Palestinian state alongside Israel based on 1967 borders. That would include definitely East Jerusalem as the capital of the Palestinian state. Mm -hmm.